<laughs> hey guys, it's Inigo, and welcome to another weekly video. I missed a week of the update video, and I missed a couple other videos this week, and I will be putting timestamps in the description to other parts of this video, because first I want to just talk a little bit about my health and a little bit of a health update, so if you're not interested, like, you know, feel free to click through. Um, so, I've always been really open about my struggles with my mental health, my physical health. I have a hormonal imbalance which changes the way that certain chemicals are interpreted by my brain, basically. And in general, you know, I've always been open about this and talked about it in videos, but it's um, when it gets this bad, it's difficult for me because there is, of course, like, you know, shame and uncomfortableness and all that sort of stuff. Um, so it, it's not that easy to talk about it, but it's been going pretty, pretty badly and you don't have to, like, worry about me because I have a couple of doctors that are working with me and I've been trying different types of medication. Um, one of the issues that I had this uh, these past couple weeks was that I was taking uh, a higher dose of medication and that made it so much worse. So now we gotta switch it around and add some other things. So I'm kind of adjusting to that as well. Um, yeah, and you know, it's like almost Christmas. I absolutely hate Christmas mostly. Uh, it's not my favorite holiday at all. And, you know, it's always this thing like, you gotta be happy, you gotta be excited, and all that stuff. And oftentimes that's just not reality, right? Um, and then, of course, the weather, you know, it's cold and dreary, and seasonal depression is a thing. So, yeah. I also don't like talking about it because I feel like, you know, it's just gonna seem like. You know, I'm just asking for sympathy, and I really don't, you know, want or need that right now. Um, but I just want to keep you guys updated because I'm always really transparent, or I try to be, about how I'm feeling, what's going up, going on, what's up, what's going on, stuff like that. And I also have the hope that, you know, people that are also struggling, if they're seeing this, if they're hearing this, they can. Um, I guess relate and understand that they're not alone. Nobody's alone with these types of things. It's very common and there is help available and you can still have a life even if you're dealing with things that seem like impossible to deal with. They still are able to be managed and coped with and all that stuff. So, um, with that, you know, I just want to say everyone that is struggling right now, especially with these holidays, it's going to be okay. We're all going to be okay. I know that it's very tough right now, but there is a light at the end of it, and there are very, very many people that do understand and that are willing to stand by you, to support you, to love you. So. I hope that you have people like that in your life, and if not, I hope you find them, because I know there are many, many out there that would be a good fit for you. So, yeah, let's do this uh, tad report thing. I also do some triggers at the end, but, um, let's see. So I have two tad reports to show you, basically, because... I didn't do last week's. So we have the TAD report for December 10th. Uh, we had 88 unique funders, and in total you guys earned me $21 and 35 cents. So thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you so much <laughs> for your TAD that week. And let's see what we had. Joey, Archerion, Dominic G, Mako, Crabbit Fox, Viper, Trevor, Pat, Eli, Jim, Blight, Stella Sombra, 
Brett's G, Tiger Lily, Sky Fox, Spitfire, Firefly, 30 Tree, <laughs> Kindred Garden, Sebastian LaCroix, Emily, Marshmallow, Valhalla, um, Larista, De Peter, Ashrin, Defective Tactic, Natus, Harkness, My GF Loves ASMR, <laughs> Angeline, Best Chip, uh, Harry Cornflake, Andrew, Lava de Science, Malkovic, and Jason E. So thank you all so much for sending me that and leaving me very lovely messages. And then in the Tad report for the December 17th, we had 79 unique funders and a total of $15.00. For some reason, there are no messages with that one, which is strange. Um, is that still an option? Does the link still work? Let me know. So I will read some of the messages from the one from last week. Mm. Thanks for your content. You're one of the better ASMR channels on YouTube, and I love what you do. Angela, Kira, Jackie are my favorite personas and I wish you would do something more with the kit soon. Well, I did, so I hope you enjoyed that one. But there is another one that will be coming, so don't worry. <laughs> Thank you. Um, hmm. For the Vampire Queen, I give my tributes and my thanks. Thank you. <laughs> hmm. I hope you're having a good week, Lisa. Stay safe and be well. We love you. Mm. Love you guys too. <laughs> Hi Lisa, I hope you're feeling better. I just wanted to say another quick thank you. It's been a crazy week and I probably wouldn't have slept at all if it weren't for how much your content helps me unwind. I hope you have a, had a good week. Thank you. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry to hear that you've been having such a rough week, but will slow down soon and I'm very glad that my videos are able to help with that. So I think we're gonna have to do some triggers. I feel like I haven't made videos in so long that I kind of forgot how to, but I think it should be fine. Um, let's see. I'm gonna have to get a plushie and make some sounds, some fabric sounds. She is from uh, Tea Turtle. It's this website that sells like shirts and socks and plushies, and I have a whole lot of really cute ones. Um, so I'm just going to show you a couple. Um, this is one of their unicorn plushies. As you can see, it's quite adorable. Well, their plushies are kind of like rotund. <laughs> um, so you can see he's a very angry unicorn. And he has a... I guess kind of like a rainbow mane and tail. And of course... Boop! <laughs> he's very angry, but I don't think he looks very menacing. Tiny plushies, and I got a couple of them in a Black Friday sale where they had a grab bag, and you could get a couple of them um, for cheap, but 
didn't know which one she would get. That's okay, because I got cute ones. This mane makes very soft, crunchy sounds. And then I have this one, which is basically the same one, but it's pink. It's kind of hard to see on camera. It looks kind of orangey, but it's like very hot pink. By the way, as I'm recording this, um, Nora's live stream is still open. This was the first plushie that I got from Tea Turtle, and it is a little octopus. But the fun thing about him is, is that he's reversible. That's so cool, right? So on one side, he's a happy purple. like these actually have a different color and that one is pink and light blue and I also have one that's reversible that's a Siamese cat I got that one because my parents' old cat was the same age. He passed away last year. So I wanted something to remember him by. Make nice squishy sounds.
I hope you enjoyed a little moment of tranquility in your day. See you again very soon.